you. Uh, for the first time in nearly 30 years, the Arizona State Legislature has expelled a member. Representative Don Shooter, a Republican from Yuma, is out. The end of a sexual harassment scandal that started back in October. ABC 15's Melissa Blasius live at the state capitol for us. And Melissa, you were inside the chamber for that historic and emotional vote. Yes, I was. And a lot of the lawmakers here consider each other not just colleagues, but friends. So there were tears on the House floor today as they made a tremendous and difficult decision to kick out a man who had been voted in by the people of Arizona. This was Shooter's last stand. Can't go back to the past. I can't change it, but I can change the future if given the opportunity. Mr. Shooter, how do you vote? Uh, I vote no. Months of a sexual harassment scandal crescendoed into this vote. The clerk will record the action of the House. Mr. Shooter is expelled. Don Shooter is the first legislator to be expelled since the as scam bribery case in 1991. Colleagues tried to avoid this, privately asking him to resign. This morning I, I asked my friend, Mr. Shooter, to respect all of us and to make a hard decision himself. He chose not to. In the hours before the vote, the House Speaker went to Don Shooter's Capitol office to confiscate his gun. Uh, there have been some folks con uh, expressing concern about safety um, and, you know, making sure that today in the height of the emotions that nothing even more tragic occurred. And just before voting began, a group of female legislators hugged Representative Michelle Ugenti Rita on the House floor. She was the first woman to publicly accuse Shooter of making unwanted sexual advances. Other women say he grabbed his private parts in front of them, made crude comments. Eugenie Rita did not make a statement after the vote, but she said this yesterday. Uh, this process has been very, very painful to go through, um, but at the end of the day, on behalf of myself and the other women who came forward, I will be supporting the motion for expulsion. Everybody thought long and hard about what to do, and they voted their conscience. And the Yuma County Board of Supervisors will choose the person to fill out the rest of Don Shooter's term. Coming up at 6 p.m., how the Me Too movement fueled the vote today. Back to you.